My final dessert I'm going to make is banana boats. All you need is bananas, um, chocolate chips, marshmallows, peanut butter, and graham cracker. Now again, like I said before in my other recipes, this is anything you want to put in. So if you just want chocolate, put chocolate. If you want peanut butter, put peanut butter. If you want marshmallows, just put marshmallows. Anything you want to put in these boats, you can do. It has to go in the oven as well. So remember, uh, to preset, preheat your oven at 400 degrees and um, let it preheat. And we're going to go ahead and put it in our oven after I cut our bananas. Now let's like, peel this off. Okay. Wonderful. And I always have a trash little bin over here. <clears throat> okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and just cut down the middle right here just to make a little boat for our bananas. It might be easier doing with this, uh, a fork, but I have a baby fork to put that in, so I'm gonna go ahead and just carve that out. Now be a little fragile with bananas, because bananas are <laughs> easy to break, such as this one. But anyway, just like this, or however you prefer. Um, all right, I'm gonna go ahead and stuff it, but before I'm gonna stuff it, you do need tin foil or aluminum foil. So I'm gonna take out just a little bit of it. This is such a big one, I'm gonna slice it in half. Put that around here. I'm gonna go ahead and lay this on there, because we're gonna wrap it up. But this one, I'm going to add peanut butter to this one. I'm kind of going to make a peanut butter chocolate mix with this. <clears throat> I'm going to smear that on there. Like so. Yum. This is so good. Okay. And I'm going to use the chocolate chips. All right, just uh, place it on the peanut butter. That'd be really easy. Okay, and they're just gonna melt and make it delicious. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this in our twin foil, just like that. Here's one banana boat. And our second banana boat is this one right over here. I'm just gonna slice it a little bit right in the middle. And fork it out just a little bit. Just like so. I always used to make this recipe when I was a child. Oh, so fun. My mom. We love bananas. And it's just so just easy. I mean, who ever thought? Okay, I'm gonna put a little bit of marshmallows on it. Beep. Just like that. Maybe two, because that's a lot of marshmallow. That's a big marshmallow, so I'll put two on there. Boop. All right. Of course, chocolate. Can't forget chocolate. <clears throat> it's going to stick it on our banana. It's going to stick on there pretty well. It's just so cute looking. Look at the little boat. All these little chocolate chips and marshmallows are saved because they're on the boat. Look at that. All right. I'm gonna add our graham cracker. Just a sprinkle. Look at that, just a little sprinkle. Okay, tin foil it. Transport to the tin foil. Okay, <clears throat> that kind of looks like s'mores. It's like a s'mores boat. I actually did not realize that until now. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and put this on our cookie sheets and stick this in the oven for about five to six minutes. It's been five minutes, and now we're ready to take out our banana boats.
cute little oven mitten. Okay, let's do this. Oh man. Turn off the oven. Make sure you do that, do not forget. Okay, let me get a plate out real quick. Okay. This is so exciting. It's like open up in a present. Boom! Yumminess. All right, I'll make sure I have a fork out. Actually, the foil's not that hot. Okay, let's see what it looks like. All right. Our marshmallows seem to stick everywhere else besides the banana, but that's okay. It's still going to be great. Let's try this one. Oh yeah, look at that one. There we go. Let's see how it tastes. This is the peanut butter one. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. That's a really good dessert. It's pretty healthy. You don't feel guilty after it. And it only takes about five minutes. Those are just banana boats. I hope you enjoy.